Hey there, friends, Brian King here. There's the old saying in the business community that, hey, you gotta think big to be successful. Don't think small, think big. Well, sometimes to get started, you absolutely need to think small. So as I'm reflecting upon the way people are making money and the way I seek out services to help me do my job better, it occurs to me how many people I have given money to over the years who only did one thing for me. That's it. One thing, and I paid them money. I think back a couple of years where it came to my attention. Well, actually, what it came from is a, a colleague of mine had this real neat caricature of her where she was dressed up as a superhero. And I asked her, you know, where did you get that done? And she pointed me to a website called Fiverr. If you're not familiar with it, check it out. It's spelled F-I-V-E-R-R.com. What Fiverr is, is this website where you can get inexpensive tasks done for you. I've used people at Fiverr to format my book into Kindle format so I can upload it to Amazon.com. When I look at all the parameters that Amazon needed, it was like stereo instructions. And I said to myself, I don't have the time to monkey with this and try and figure out how the heck to do it. It would take me two or three days. So I went to Fiverr to see if there was anybody out there that did this. Lo and behold, there were dozens of people that did this on Fiverr, where all they did was offer to format your book into Kindle for a set fee. And it also had reviews of how easy the person was to work with, how fast they got it back to you. So I took my chances on one, and boom, I got it done. And it maybe took... It's, you know, cost like a hundred bucks to get it done. And when you consider how much time it saved me by delegating it to somebody else, I think it was worth it. I got my money's worth. I also found the person on Fiverr that did the superhero caricatures. I don't remember how I spent, how much I spent on this person, but that was worth it because this was a unique branding thing. Now, I don't use it anymore. But at the time, it was a really cool thing to have. It created a lot of buzz, a lot of conversation. So at the time, it was absolutely worth it. I also remember a story that I heard a couple of years ago. I think I read it in an article. Tried to find it on Google, didn't have much luck. But it was about a man that had a form of autism. And he wasn't really good with people, but he had a stellar memory. And he was hired by an older gentleman I can't remember if he owned a, a locksmith shop or what he owned, but it was something that required knowledge of a lot of inventory of small parts. Well, this gentleman with autism memorized the entire catalog that had the vendors, part numbers, prices, everything you would need. And somebody asked him, why don't you just get a computer to do all that? And the guy said, well, I can't afford a computer. But not to mention, if I did buy the computer, this guy didn't, wouldn't have a job. You know, one of the big pushes in business these days is to cut costs. And one of those ways they do it is to get rid of people. Well, this gentleman working in a small shop realized the value of investing in a person as opposed to technology. You know, because this guy with autism was very withdrawn, very introverted he quite likely would be isolated in an apartment somewhere living off a disability if this gentleman didn't give him a job. Why did he employ him? Because he was good at one thing. He memorized the catalog. Now, that's a unique skill. My memory sucks. But that and the examples on Fiverr just go to show that you do not need to be a generalist and be good in all eight subjects you're taught in school. You don't necessarily have to have a college degree to be of value to someone. You just need to be able to solve a problem that saves them time. It's something they don't want to do for themselves. It's a skill they don't have, and it's going to bring value to their life. If you've got that one thing, go and set yourself up a profile on Fiverr and start telling the world that you can do this. And more likely than not, you will find people that need the very thing you can do, and you can start making some money. Might not be a billion bucks, but hey, it's money you didn't have before.
So give it a shot. Show the world your brilliance and whatever one thing you've got, start making some money and start feeling better about what you can bring to the world. Those are just my thoughts. This has been Brian. Please share this with people that you can think can benefit from this as well. If you happen to be watching the replay of this, please type hashtag replay in the comments. And if you need more ideas, leave some comments and suggestions in the comments, and I'll see what I can do for you. Take care. Thanks for being you.